Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to RPG Madness. And today we are going to be fighting another boss. I actually found the Elf Hunter, the only one from Legendary Beast we haven't seen so far. And also I found this really cool structure. It like starts at the ground and goes like a thousand feet into the air. It's really cool. I don't know if there's a boss, but it's definitely worth checking out. Um, but anyways, before we leave, I really wanted to make some ammo for my revolver. I know we got this like really early in the series, and I never really used it because I had no ammo. Um, but now we're going to make ammo and test it out. So it's cobblestone and iron ingots, and that makes nine, so we're going to get like hundreds right here. So here we go. That's like 200 bullets. It's probably not that powerful, um, but it should be cool. I know it's going to be like nowhere near the strength of our crystal bow, which is like freaking amazing. So I'm going to put down, let me put down this cobblestone right here. And we are going to leave. I did the same thing as normal. I like set up a teleporter like really far away. I'm trying to find like stuff in this series we haven't done. So I'm like searching off camera and then setting up these teleporters. So we can get there like really easily from our house. Alright, so as you guys know, the pirate ship is like right here from last episode. But I set up a second teleporter. I thought it'd be cool. Like we could always like walk by here, see the scenery. Remember the times of when we were on that ship. And we can go here. I made a red teleporter by the way. It's like the first red one I ever made. And this one brings me to this structure. It starts at the bottom. And it's like a ladder, like, all the way up into the sky. It's kind of cool. Um, but I don't think we should fight it just yet. Whatever it's there. I don't even know what we're fighting, but we shouldn't go there just yet. Because we don't know if there's a boss. But I know for sure that there's a boss at the Elf Hunter because, you know, it's just a little structure. Which is right here. Next teleporter. And bam. We're here. There's the structure. Oh, before we fight him, we should probably switch our pet to the companion cube. Because we got Randa right now, which is jumping. Like, I, I don't know how much that's going to help. Companion cube, though. What is shooting at me? Oh, my God. There's a gas right there. What are you doing? You gas are so annoying in this series, I have to say. The nether mod makes the gas freaking really annoying. And he's so high, I can't even hit him. But, yeah, I think he'll ignore us. Maybe. Just go over here a little bit. But yeah, the companion cube is going to be really useful protecting us from fire damage. And yeah, you wouldn't think like this little square with a heart would be so amazing. But it really is. It's been like the most useful pet in the entire series. By the way, guys, I am predicting a rare spawn. I can feel it. I can feel the rare spawn. It's going to happen. Let's see. Come on. You hear the shrieking of a beast? Oh my god, I was right. I was right. It's a rare spawn. <laughs> It's got cloaking, blast off, and bulwark. Oh god, it's got double defense. It's like it has 2,000 hit points. Alright, die, bro. Die. This is gonna be hard. At least we won't take fire damage. I'm just gonna, like, wreck havoc right now. And yeah, he's gonna take half the damage he normally would. So I'm doing, like, 10 damage a hit. Normally I'd be doing, like, 20. He's not very accurate from there. He's got blast off, which knocks you into the air like that. Ow. Okay, that's gonna be the most annoying part of the fight, definitely. And apparently, he can cloak himself and go invisible, which he has not done quite yet. Alright, let me get behind this, like, pillar right here. This is gonna be tough. The Elf Hunter is epic today. Oh, God. Oh, right into the air again. But luckily, I was able to, like, stop myself there. Where is he? Hello? Oh, God. Where, where'd he go? Oh, he must be invisible, huh? That's bad. Elf Hunter? Seriously, where is the Elf Hunter? Did you fall in a cave? He fell in the cave. The <laughs> elf hunter fell in the cave. You noob. He fell right in the cave. I got you right where I want you now, bro. Got you right where I want you. I'm just gonna get you in the head. He's still knocking me. He's like jumping up and hitting me from there. You think it'd be easier from this position, but it's not. He's down to 650. Oh, God. You two, don't double team. What are you, his friend? Killed him. Awesome. They're like teaming me. It's not nice. All right, we got the Elf Hunter. He's down to 629. Yeah, he's an epic boss fight because he's got so much health and all these cool effects, too. Keeps knocking me into the air. It makes it much more difficult than it normally would. All right, let's take him down. Take him down. He's down to 525. I wish I did more damage. That um Bulwark is, like, so overpowered. All right, he's down to 428. I knew he wouldn't be fighting on the platform. I don't think I've ever fought the Elf Hunter and it actually stayed in his little, like, area where he spawns. It never does. He either knocks you really far back or you knock him really far back. <laughs> Got on the vine. He couldn't knock me into the air. This blast off. You're about to die, bro. You have so much freaking health. It's amazing. I'm taking some damage, but it's not too bad. Our armor is all right. It's not great. Oh, man. Try to get out of there. Is he coming out? 
Hello? He's right there. He, he just can't get out of the place. That really sucks for him. So once we kill him, we'll see what he drops. Since he's rare spawn, he'll drop something extra, too. So he's gonna drop, like, all kinds of stuff. He's down to 136. Should I just go down? Let's just, let's do it. Let's battle it out down in the freaking cave. Come on, bro. Let's go. 58, 48, 35. Almost got him. At least he doesn't have one up. That'd just be torturous. He's dead. And he dropped... Oh, he dropped the blowgun. And he dropped the other weapon, too. Wow, he dropped all kinds of stuff. Like, normally he just drops... Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at myself. Am I all right? I don't know. I think I need to go to the hospital. <laughs> um, but let's see here. He actually dropped the blowgun, the poison blowgun, which poisons enemies, and he dropped the enchanted bow. Usually he only drops one. What does this have? Whoa! Power six, punch one, infinity, and flame one. That's one of the best enchantments I've ever seen him drop before. And he did drop a shovel too, because he was a rare spawn. So yeah, wow. I got really lucky there. Let me out of this. Let me out of here. I don't want to be in here forever. We've killed him. I actually think we should go back to our house real quick and repair my armor. Like, the chest plate, since it has thorns on it, which is, you know, it's helpful. But the thing is, um, the durability goes out a little bit quicker. We have 59 levels. He drops all kinds of experience, so we should be fine anyway. All right, so lots of teleporters to go over right now. All right, go on this one. Do this one. Come on. You have to, like, wait a second. There's, like, a cooldown on the teleporters. There we go. Let me just eat, like, in between. Take a snack. Got the worm right there. It's kind of gross. They dance, though. They, they dance sometimes. Dance for me. Of course, you don't listen. I don't know if they dance, like, right when you put them down. But I noticed that. All right. So, let's repair this stuff. Of course, I could use, um, what is it? The washing machine or whatever. Or dishwasher. But it's so much easier to just throw it into the enchantment table. Like, it saves so much time. The other thing takes, like, ten minutes. So, repair this. Eight levels. That's fine. Not a big deal. We're going to get all kinds of stuff, like, in the next area, too. So, I really don't mind doing it. Let's just up this protection a little. Why not? I don't know what's to come. It might be something really difficult. So I'll repair that and put the protection all the way up. And yeah, we should be pretty strong now. All right, so still got all the arrows in me. But I'm feeling much better. And we're ready to go. I still got 38 levels anyway. Okay. I really hope it's another boss. It's like one we haven't fought yet. But you never know. I feel like there's so many structures in better dungeons. You never know if it's going to be like the same boss. Like, that you fought already. Oh, by the way, by the way, by the way, there is a weeping angel right there. I know last time I saw one, a bunch of people thought it was actually from the weeping angel mod, which I do not have installed. But it's from Gravestones. So it doesn't really do anything. It just kind of looks cool, you know? But we can't take it home. It's right, right next to our teleporter. So if we want to, we can do that. But I'm going to switch to Reyna. Switch to Reyna. So we can jump over here. Big jump. If I talk, if I like right click you, do you say anything? Slain by Enderman. It's actually getting dark. All right. It's very sad. Notch was slain by Enderman. It's depressing. Or did they, like, kick you out of heaven or something? It seems like this is where that goes. But I do have an idea, guys. We got Raina for a reason. So there is, um... What is it? A ladder that goes all the way up. But we're going to try to fly up with our electric staff. And it's probably going to run out of durability. I'm somehow going to land on the ground and die. So I switched. All right. Here we go. One, two, and three. Let's go for it. This is so cool. The durability is going down really quickly. We've almost got it. Oh, there we go. And it's gone. Just made it. And we're into the new structure. Look how high we are. It's pretty cool. Yeah, even if we haven't, like, you know, if we don't fight a boss or if we fight a boss we've already fought before, at least we killed the elf hunter. Plus, it was like a rare one, which is always cool. Got my gun. Die. Five damage. Six damage. Not too bad, right? Four damage. Um, it looks to have a cooldown. If you look at the durability on it, like, it goes down after you shoot it, and once it goes back up, you can shoot again. So it's, it's not very practical for quick killing at all. It's, it's terrible, actually. <laughs> but I'm killing stuff. I'm killing stuff. I was motivated by the pirates who were shooting me last time. What the heck was that? Do you have... Oh, my God. That's... Give me that back. Don't, don't do this to me. Don't mess with me. Get everything. There's a rare spawn that's really evil. Okay. I think we're all right. Is everything going to come down here to the first floor? Yeah, the gun's not that bad. It's kind of cool, actually. All right. What is upstairs? There's like a bunch of different levels to this place. Might be cool to add this to like our house somehow. You know, like set up a teleporter in it. I'm not sure yet. I need to check it like out. Oh my God, he's got the big sword. Oh my God, that was awesome. I think that's the first time I've seen that. Wow, that was cool. 
All right, so pretty much everything came from this floor, and we fought it already. So it's kind of cleared out. Let's see, some food. Nice. Don't really need any. Why did you not stay stacked? Stack yourself. It's better. All right, how about in here? Iron stuff. Not that we really need. Anything above this? Oh, it brings us right to the next floor. I could just jump up there if I wanted to. But I should probably follow the stair thing. Are the mobs going to chase me? Die. Die. I'm trying to, like, find a good way to kill everything from here. They didn't chase me down this time. Die, archer. Oh, it's one of those lost souls from, like, the nether mob. Those things are so annoying. All right, I am going to shoot you. Wait. There's my gun. I was like, where is it? I got nervous. Hold on a second. Thank you. All right. We will tread on in this dungeon. It's like a dungeon, right? All right, so I'm gonna shoot these dudes. It doesn't do that much damage, but it's funny. I'm just shooting them with a gun. They have swords. You, d you don't bring a sword to a gunfight, bro. This is what happens. You die. I shoot you right in the face. An arrow to it, it's really not that good compared to a gun. I know it's not that strong though. And I guess this lasts forever. That'd be my guess, because it's not running out of durability. Did anyone else hear an explosion? It scared me a little bit. Dead. No. I was hoping it was going to one-hit kill him. Okay. Everyone heard what happened, and they're all coming down. All right. And here, nothing. Healer. Who are you going to heal? Everyone's dead. Should I grab the iron ingots? Yeah, let's do it. Let's see. Don't see anything over there. And some more food. So, let me put down this glowstone dust. Anything else we don't... Dirt. They can have the dirt. All right. So, I want to test out some more stuff, too. I have the bones, too. Let's see. Anything up here? All right, that's an ice pig, man. I don't think he'll hit me. Who hit me? Wasn't you, right? We're friends. Was it you? You're freaking scary. Oh, it's you. I didn't I didn't see you at all. I did not see that silverfish. Please kill him. Just finish him before he can get to me. Got him. Got him. Didn't even have to do anything. Are his friends coming? Yeah, they are. Only one. A lot of stuff in this room. All right, what we can do is um, test out this. The ninja dagger. I guess it, like, makes a clone of you if you, like, shift and right-click at the same time. Do I have to, like, do it towards someone? Kill them. Okay, you're doing a really bad job at fighting back, team. All right, they're, they're attacking, sort of. I don't know. That didn't work out that good. It didn't work as good as it should have. But it's kind of cool. The other me is right there, ready to fight. Don't dodge that. Well, you're not dodging it, but you're, like, reflecting it. Reflecting is cheap, all right? It's cheap. Okay, you're on fire. <laughs> Died anyway. Help me out. We could kill them as a team. We'd make an amazing team anyway. Don't you think? No? I like your sword. It's cool. All right, so um, our inventory is filling up, so I'm going to put some stuff away. Like, all this essence. Like, don't really need it on me this exact second. Is someone walking towards me? No. Get scared. There's more ice pig men we're taking over. We are a team, after all. All right, healer. Oh, kill that thing. I didn't even mean to kill it. There's a lot of screaming going on in this place. Checking everything out. Weird room. There's like water and, and lava. Die. Die where I spawned. You had one up. Well, now you're dead. And I really don't want that iron hoe at all. Not at all. Oh, where do you guys come from? Top floor. It's where the epic stuff is. Hope there's a boss. Diamonds. Silverfish all around. A couple more chests over there, too. Is it raining out? Yeah, it's pouring. Horrible weather. Okay, so protection three on these chain boots, but I don't really need to spend all my inventory on stuff like that. Oh, my God. There's a lot of those things. <laughs> they just killed each other. And you just blew everything up. That's rude. That is really rude. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just break a hole. Why not? It's going to be easier. Oh, give me the diamonds. Thank you. Let's see. Yeah, that's going to be a little easier to get up there if I just jump through it. Let's see what's up here. Oh! It's you again. Don't ever do that. Those things are annoying. Wow. Oh, it's... Okay, I'm up. I'm up. You're dead. Die, everybody. Everyone, please. There's so many mobs. <laughs> so many. All right, that one's dead. That one's dead. Okay, almost everything's dead here. 
There's Ice Pig Man. Like, oh, fall off the edge. <laughs> he fell right off. Um, the Ice Pig Man, I don't need to mess with them if I do accidentally. Of course, they're all going to go after me. So I'm trying not to. Oh, he's sitting on a... Look. He's dancing in on a spider. Hey, hey. Minotaurus, what are you doing up here? What are you doing up here? This is the wrong place for you. Should be a boss around here somewhere. It's kind of dark. Oh, I'm so sorry. You scared me. That is a lot of damage for a pickaxe. Yeah, you don't don't freak me out like that, Ice Pig Man. Don't ever do that again. Okay, so where's the Moonworm Queen? Okay, so I'm gonna light it up a bit. Let's see. So we need some emeralds. You grab those. What do I have here? Poison potion. Don't really need that. Don't need this. Don't need this. Don't need this. Um, I'll grab the gold ingots. Why not? I'm just tempted to grab stuff. I'm a greedy person. In here, a bunch of enchantments on, like, stone swords. Do we, do we really need stone swords? I already have a longbow, too. And a bunch of food. Alright. Let's see. Where are we going with this? So, I'd imagine there might be a boss in there. So, I'm gonna, like, go around. Oh! That is the boss! Oh, it's a necromancer. We already fought the necromancer, right? Dudes all look the same to me. Where are you going? I'm sorry what I did to your friend. Oh, God. I'm sorry what I did. I didn't mean it. We're all friends here. The necromancer is... How many of you live in there? What the hell are you? Seriously, what the hell are you? Alright, Ice Ghost, you're dead. Don't jump. Don't no, do not do suicide. Don't do it. Don't do suicide. There's another structure exactly the same as here. Are we friends or something? What's going on? What's going on, necromancer? You want to be friends? Or do you want to die? About to kill you. Kill the necromancer. Another boss is down. He's kind of easy at this point. He's one of the weaker bosses from the mod, so, you know, it's not too surprising. Give me your bone. Awesome. So, we've got another cursed bone. And these are the things that summon, like, um, what do they do? They summon, like, skeletons to help fight for you, which are awesome. All right. Let's see. You guys. I'm sorry, Ice Ghost. Please don't look at me ever again. It freaks me out. All right. Is everything cleared around here? It's in here. All right. A couple chests. Some more food. Have some great... I'm adding to the food chest. Trying to help out. Alright, in here. Whoops. Ooh, diamonds, emeralds, block... All kinds of stuff in here. Give me all this stuff. And more food. But yeah, this is like the main spot right here. So there's probably gonna be the best stuff in here. I'd imagine. Anything in here? It's kind of dark. Any mobs? Oh! Oh, I'm sorry about before. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright. So this has got to be where the reward is. Oh, there it is. Awesome. Okay. So, yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Let me put stuff in my bag. We've got some room. Okay, so, yeah, shovel. Blocks of ice, emeralds, all kinds of stuff. I just need to put some of it away right now. All right, so, we've got a block of gold, emeralds, a music disc. Big iron sword. Tempting, isn't it? It's so big that it's tempting. Bunch of enchanted stuff I don't need too badly. And, oh, Another block of gold, some iron ingots, eyes of ender, another hook shoot, and a music disc. We have like a million hook shoots. We have a billion of them. Oh, we still need to test out this um, poison blowgun. I hear mobs. Gotta be around here somewhere. What is that? Is that a bug? There's a skeleton. Come here. It didn't even poison you. Why does it not poison you? Maybe it only does it like part of the time. I thought it would. I'm sad. All right, so I think we conquered this place, guys. It's cool. Should we use this? This might be a cool spot. It is pretty damn cool looking. But yeah, there's another one, like, right over there. What's the chance of that? You can actually see the spawner things from here, like the one-time spawners. Uh, but guys, it is time for the Fanshin. And today's winners were Bill Agner, Zen Nakana, it's a hard one to say, and J King 2800 Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time.